Welcome to this tutorial. Um, we're learning to simplify ratios. Hope you're enjoying your technology classes, which is what you're doing while I'm recording this tutorial. Um, so what is a ratio? A ratio, for example, 2 to 5 is a ratio, and all it is is an ordered comparison of quantities or amounts. So this ratio might re represent that Jessica has $2 and John has $5, um, so the ratio of Jessica's money to John's money is 2 to 5. So we would say the ratio 2 to 5. When we're simplifying ratios, we're trying to bring them down to the lowest form they can be, um, very much like simplifying fractions. So in this example, um, we're looking to try if we can divide both numbers, both ratio numbers by the same number, um, we'll therefore get a smaller number. So looking for a number that goes into both 2 and 4. And if we divide 2 by 2, we get 1. And if we divide 4 by 2, we get 2. So the ratio 2 to 4 in a simplified form is 1 to 2, or in its most simpler, simple form. Let's try one more example. 20 to 50. Looking for a number that we can divide that goes into both 20 and 50. And 10 would be such a number. So 20 divided by 10 gives us 2. 50 divided by 10 gives us 5. So the simplest form for 20 to 50 is 2 to 5. If a ratio is, one of the ratio numbers is less than zero, then we need to multiply both numbers to bring it up to its simplest form. So in this example, one third to two, what do we need to do to one third to um, bring it up to one? Well, we're going to times by three. One third times three equals one. Two times three equals six. 0.8 to the ratio 0 0.6. Um, in this example, it's probably easiest to look at what number can we multiply both of those decimal fractions in order to get a whole number. And in this case, I would multiply them by 5. So 0 0.8 times 5 equals 4. 0 0.6 times 5 equals 3. So the simplest ratio form for 0 0.8 to 0 0.6 is actually 4 to 3.